Most of us are aware that the UFO phenomenon is very real. Not only is it real, but the research into what UFOs are is massively financed by various governments across the world. The thought that in this day and age, we still see things in the sky that does not belong to any known country on Earth has led to countless claims as to what they actually are. We assume they are alien because they are not of this Earth, but what is alien? Is this another worldly civilization or is it divine in origin? Throughout history, UFOs have been present as human civilization has spread across the planet. They are consistent in every culture from the very first depictions right into the today and now. You have to wonder why this is. Are we being monitored by an alien civilization or are we being watched by our creator gods? Wait till you hear this. Luis Elizondo, a former member of the Advanced Aerospace Threat Identification Program, has revealed that the information he gathered relates that the UFO phenomenon is either demonic or divine in origin. He claims his work has been undermined by several high-ranking military officials in an effort to keep this information from going public. Originally started to monitor threat levels from other countries, the Advanced Aerospace Threat Identification Program uncovered evidence of highly advanced aerodynamic craft with abilities that are so advanced that no country on Earth has developed anywhere near such technological advancements. They have recordings of experienced Air Force pilots absolutely dumbstruck as to what they are witnessing, unexplainable by human standards. The Pentagon's research is one in part with religious belief. In this sense, it may be hampered by the fact that some of the researchers' belief in God meant that they simply would not entertain the idea of alien life. From that closed-minded approach, only false thinking would prevail and UFOs are always explained as being of human origin by these officials. If you consider deep-rooted religious belief, then you are to believe that Satan, according to the Bible teachings, is the prince of power of the air. This means some people see this as demonic presence. It does seem that the top brass are heavily getting in the way of investigations based on their belief. This is further proof of a massive cover-up of the truth. What do you guys think of this anyway? Comments below and thank you for watching.